Welcome to Starbound News. Hello everyone, I'm Giles. And I'm the new Anchorman, Renor. After making some bad investments, Fruk has gone bankrupt and could not be with us tonight. Rest in peace. But that's all good because we have another week's worth of updates for you all. On today's show, we will be bringing you the latest news on three printers, status effects and tiered weapons. But firstly, we are going to show you just a couple of smaller features that have been added to the game this week. Okay, so this week we got to look at the new Apex NPC villages and also NPC humanoids which will be running around causing all sorts of trouble. Also code has been added that allows mountains and canyons to be generated into the world along with a lot more. And also fish w swim away from you when you get close to them in water. Oh, well, that's because you pee in the water, isn't it? No. Uh, pretty much, yeah. No, what are you talking about? <laughs> well, anyways, T has announced unconfirmed idea of his to save space stations for your guild or corporation. This idea has got a lot of community feedback and hopefully will be added into the game. We will hopefully be seeing some Apex dungeons within the coming week as development has started on those. The human intro has been finished and the next one is currently being worked on. The 3D printing interface is now finished. It's a major feature in the crafting side of the game and will allow you to gather s schematics, import them into the printer and print out a physical copy in the game. Yes, now I can print a friend. Flying monsters now have new abilities such as swooping, landing and shooting projectiles, while Logan Cunningham voice actor of Bastion, has been recording voiceovers for the cutscenes this week, and from what Ty has said, they sound pretty amazing. All the tiered weapons have been completed. These weapons can be crafted using all mines within the planets. The combat has been tweaked around, and throughout the week, there, ha there is now knockback based on the damage you cause. The staff have been messing around in the Starbound universe, and have created their own version of the Hunger Games. T says to expect future live streams of these events and that they are a lot of fun. May the odds ever be in your favour. Ah, uh, shut up. With that in mind, Chucklefish has also created a new Twitch channel that you can check out, and fairy costumes have been added to the game. Um, isn't that your sister's? Um, no. Finally, the developers have also added status effects to the game. These include fire and poison effects, which will create flames or green bubbles. So that's all for this week, guys. Make sure you tune in next week on... You ready? Hell yeah! Three, Three two, two, one... one. Stop, Stop. Oh, you.